It's so quiet. There's no noise at all. It's so eerie. And how do I have a map of this place? It looks like it's a maze. Dead ends. Like, this isn't a place people actually live or anything. It's just hallways. It's not built right. That goes down. There's another pathway this way. That also goes down. That also goes down. Oh God. That camera shot is so damn good. A great knife. Oh, I'm super hurt. Massive weapon wielded by Pyramid Head. Hard to use, but lethal. I have Pyramid's head. Pyramid Head's knife? Oof. Gotta drag the damn thing. I suppose that's what they do too, isn't it? Oof. Doesn't that sound an oof? It's like the wind, just air being displaced. All right, I don't think I want to use this thing. If nothing else, it's Pyramid Head's freaking weapon. I don't want to become the new Pyramid Head, thank you. Well, it could go up here. I could keep going around. I really don't want to meet Pyramid Head again, though. All right, that's a full circle. Yeah, let's go up the ladder back here. It's such an amazing change from such loud cacophony to complete silence. So that whole thing is just a loop. Nothing down there but pyramid head. Let's go down this way then.
Once again, complete silence, except for the water. I'm nowhere. So I can move it? And I've seen a little bit of this. All I know is you need to rotate it to get the right door, the right place, because it rotates this room. I don't know which door I want, though. I don't know which way to rotate it. I mean, that's not even a door. that way. That one's upside down. Hmm, wait a minute. That hand, see that hand coming up over the mouth? Does that indicate a doorway in? Like this way doesn't have a doorway? No, it does. Okay, I don't think that hand indicates anything then. I think this is where I started. Nothing. I think I need to flip this thing over. Is that the way I started? Or oh man, I don't remember now. Oh, I think I saw something. Is that it? I think so. I don't see any other doorways. I can't see the ceiling, but. You're alive! Maria, I thought that thing killed you. Are you hurt bad? Not at all, silly. Maria? That thing, it stabbed you. There was blood everywhere. Stabbed me? What do you mean? It chased us to the elevator, and, James, and then- James, what are you talking about? Just before. Don't you remember? James, honey, did something happen to you? After we got separated in that long hallway? Are you confusing me with someone else? <laughs> you were always so forgetful. Remember that time in the hotel? Maria? You said you took everything, but you forgot that videotape we made. I wonder if it's still there. How do you know about that? 
Aren't you Maria? I'm not your Mary. So, you're Maria? I am. If you want me to be. All I want from you is an answer. It doesn't matter who I am. I'm here for you, James. See? I'm real. Don't you want to touch me? I... don't know. Come and get me. I can't do anything through these bars. Okay. Stay right there. I'll be there soon. It feels like... James has conjured up another Mary. Look at how short these st stools are. <sighs> yeah. It's weird. I feel like Mary is both something, or uh, Maria, I mean. Sorry, easy to confuse the two. <laughs> I feel like Maria is sort of conjured up by James, but at the same time, I feel like Maria is, or was, a real person. Think of the diary that we found on the roof of Brookhaven. And how we, I, I think, more or less learned that Maria was in that hospital and was severely depressed. Like that, that feels like a real person. I don't think they're just a, a figment of James, but, but uh, the thing about Silent Hills, it also feels like things that maybe were just figments of imagination have been made real. So maybe Maria was something that James just kind of wanted, sort of. Because James wanted Mary back, right? Maybe James wanted Mary back. And Silent Hill kind of messed up and twisted and perverted that desire and came up with Maria? who's kind of Mary, but kind of not. But I do also feel at the same time like they're a real person. Like they had a life before Silent Hill. I don't know, it's, God, it's confusing. And I, it's really disturbing the sinister tones in Maria's voice when we were talking with them. I'm not sure Mary seemed kind of sort of angry I don't really feel dangerous to me like I'm kind of scared of them Whew. What's that noise? Wire cutter? What am I going to do with that? for cutting wires or electric cables. There's some cables around this thing. Do I want to cut this thing some more? <laughs> I can't think of anything to cut if I go back down.
Surely I can't cut the bars or something with it. Yeah, let's go back down the ladder. Something must have changed back there. not ever seen that or I just forgot about it. Can't get through here because of the wire stretched across the path. Let's save first. on the same level as the loop around where Pyramid Head was. Where is this? Cheese.
35 handgun rounds left. I think I'm still kind of hurt, actually. Let's take another one. Yeah, now I'm green. I'm nowhere, once again. just its own separate place, not connected to anything on the map. What's this place called, I wonder? Labyrinth Hallway. I want to check this other pathway before I go up there. That's Pyramid Head. Anything behind you? Pyramid Head's just stalking me through the labyrinth. This is... This is not where I came from, actually. Just some ammo. Here we go. I think this whole thing is seems to be pretty clearly alluding to Angela being sexually assaulted when they were a child, probably, by their father. Uh, hunting rifle. Oh god. Wait, I'm still on the pistol. Oof. God, it looks so gross. That thing is so gross. Oof. God, there's so little room in here. Oh, 
<laughs> oh no. Oh no! I didn't realize how hurt I was. Are you okay? <laughs> Angela, relax. Don't order me around! I'm not trying to order you. So what do you want then? I see. You're trying to be nice to me, right? I know what you're up to. It's always the same. You're only after one thing. No, that's not true at all. You don't have to lie. Go ahead and say it. Or you could just force me. Beat me up like he always did. You only care about yourself anyway. You disgusting pig. Angela. Don't touch me! You make me sick. your wife Mary was dead, right? Yes, 
she was ill. Liar! I know about you. You didn't want her around anymore. You probably found someone else. <sighs> That's ridiculous. I never... Well, there's a lot going on here. Let's start talking about it. I mean, I don't think much is left up to the imagination about what that was all about with Angela. Christ, even this room. Look at the... Pistons. Even this monster looks like a... It's like a bed monster. Right, it's like a vaguely humanoid form underneath a bed, and every time it grabbed me, it kind of like sucked me in, trying to smother me. Ugh. Also, I just had another idea about the whole Mary Maria thing. What if Maria isn't so much different because Silent Hill twisted James's wish to have another Mary, but what if... What if James, when Mary was dying, wanted, sort of wanted or fantasized or thought about having someone else, being with someone else, because maybe it was just too heartbreaking watching their love, Mary, die, wither away? Maybe they thought about someone else, real or imagined, and maybe they felt really, really guilty about that. 